Hi, I'm Mark from MyKataska.com. This short video shows additional software protection features built into the USB mass storage device bootloader. The USB mass storage device bootloader is discussed in more detail in the Kinetis video. In this video we concentrate on just the software protection part and instead of using the Kinetis we're showing this on a SAM7 MT256 board from Olimex. With the USB mass storage device bootloader installed, we power the board via the USB cable from a PC. The bootloader is now running. The board appears as a mass storage device and we transfer the software using drag and drop. Here we can see the new code operating. In some cases it may not be desirable to be able to copy the loaded software back to the PC. For such circumstances the protected bootloader is advisable. Here we see that the uploaded code is in fact full of zeros. In order to be able to copy the software back all I have to do is to drag and drop a password file onto the disk and afterwards I can re-perform the copy function and now we see that the contents of the file contains the real software data. Many thanks for looking in and good luck with your own work using the USB mass storage device bootloader.